Moving forward, the One Kasi Arts and Culture Summit began yesterday at Uncle Tom's Hall in Orlando West. Now, this three-day summit celebrates creativity, encourages cross-cultural collaboration, and underscores the importance of the arts in society. Featuring panel discussions, workshops, and performances, the summit aims to connect artists from South Africa and the United States. Running until October 19th, it showcases a diverse array of local and international talent. Now, Soweto TV News covered the opening day and spoke with key contributors to their initiative success. It's important that we give recognition to the women in arts uh, globally. So, as you see that Rafaya and her team, they are here just to make that, continue that work that they've been doing for all these years. So, they're bringing this project to SA to uplift our women as well, to give them uh, that lifetime confidence and self-reliant and believing in, in themselves. My company comes from hip-hop and street culture, so I'm going to quote a saying, ladies first, right? Mm -hmm. Ladies first, Queen Latifah, Moni Love. Yes. And um, again, this is, this is a collaborative summit, but also we wanted to put women first and start with them because they have something to say and they've contributed heavily to the art and culture of South Africa, but all over the world. I think in the Bible, we have a cool food that we can share our practice with other fellow creatives from a different part of the world, which is the U.S. I uh, believe also Brazil is here. And we uh, are comfortable comfortable in what we do. I'm very inspired to go to the Kaya, go to the Kasi. I'm very inspired to go to the Kaya, go to the Kasi. So uh, today, the experience is very cool. I'm very inspired to go to the Kaya, go to the Kaya, go to the Kaya, go to the Kaya. Thank you.